Hey guys, in this video today, I'm going to show you how to install a E3D, for me, Light 6 on the TiVo Tornado. Let's get right into that. Okay, so basically right now you're going to need the fan wires and all the fan wires that are connected after you've snipped them. And then you're just going to want to strip the wire. Um, and so the JST connector that is on the actual um, thing for the E3D you're not going to be able to just disconnect it like this one. I've just already prepared it. You would want to snip it, but basically you're just going to want to take the wire. Let me try focusing that. And you're going to want to strip it using some kind of tool like this, like a pair of snippers. Um, and I'm sure the majority of you who are going to be doing this modification already have a pretty good idea on I don't know how I'm going to try to get that in focus. That's a little better, but basically you're going to want to strip all the positive. The positive and negatives are going to be the same thing for this fan wire. So yeah, we're going to want to do the same thing for basically all three of the wires. Um, and just wrap, wrap them up like this because I'm doing this with a non solder method basically. So we're not going to want to have to do any soldering because that's a pain in the butt to do. Um, for me at least it is. And so then just do the same thing for the negatives. Which I'll go ahead and do that really fast off camera. Okay, so basically I lost some of my footage that I recorded. And so I'm going to try to, I already have it finished. But um, what I did before was I basically... I clipped all the wires as you saw and then you do the same thing for the fan wire as coming from the E3D fan and you strip them and then you wind them up together and later on I'll show you how to actually clamp down one of these pieces uh, but you get like a JST connector piece you know I talked about it before and you just take it and you clamp down and you bend those wires over on top of each other and wind them down and you just take the clamp and you just clamp it down onto those wires, basically. And you're gonna do that for the the positive and the negatives. So basically you have all three of the wires connected in one strand connected to the connector. And so that's basically what happened. I lost my footage, I already did the part, uh, but that's basically how you do it, simplified. Um, and you just, make them all one strand basically going into one one single connector so I hope that explains this that's basically all you have to do to slide the part in now you just slide that piece in and you're finished with the fans now let's go on to the the heating cartridge okay so basically these are the heater cartridge wires now what you're gonna just want to do for these is uh, basically you're just gonna want to strip them and the other part, this is basically, I told you, the, all the ends of the wires. So this is you know, what's going to be connecting inside of the tornado. Um, and so you're just going to take them and strip them just like I showed you before. Uh, I already did this for one side, so let's just flip that over. And I'll quickly strip the other. Let me set it down. Um, and then, well, wires from a very expensive printer, but then also from the E3D, which you don't want to have happen. Um, for me, I just had that stick out the top. Uh, I'm not entirely sure what would happen if that were the case on the actual piece. So yeah, you're going to want to do the same thing for the next side, and I'll be right back after that. Okay, so basically you just have to slide these pieces right in. Um, it's actually just a two connector, and I tell you that here in a second. Um, not a three, I forgot. Um, and so yeah, let me show you the inside of the box and where everything plugs into and then I'll show you the diagram. Well, I hope you liked that video. I'll provide links to where you can get every part that I used. And I will also tell you that you should talk to professionals before you do this. And also go check out my Patreon page, which is M3D Dude.
and I will put a link to that also. So I hope you like this video. Please like, comment, and subscribe for more content like this hopefully every week. Thanks. Bye.